What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a fall clothing haul and I am so excited. I found some good pieces here. I'm really excited to share with you. Um, and this is like all the stuff I've accumulated this school year so far. The first thing that I bought, like the, the thing that I have had the longest has been this tote bag. It's just a little black tote I got from TJ. Um, I got this from TJ Maxx actually right before the school year started and it was only like, I'm pretty sure it was like $24. Super, super inexpensive. What I love about it is the shape and how it's kind of flimsy. Um, I really like tote bags that have that kind of sag to them. I don't know, I just feel like they're more effortless and chicer looking and this was so inexpensive. It's like obviously not the best quality but it's held up pretty well. The next thing is a pair of sneakers. I actually have a couple pairs of shoes but I just, Wanted to give a shout out to these because every time I post about these on my Instagram stories because sometimes I will wake up before my 8.30 and work out, I have these on and so many people ask me about where these are from because they're just so cute. They are Adidas and I bought them off of ASOS. They're the like tubular shoes. Um, they're really light and so incredibly comfortable, easy to run in and good for like just when you want to like do a little athleisure look. They have the snakeskin part which is so so cute. The thing I'm wearing right now is from She. No, it's from Romwe. Um, I'm obsessed with this sweater, you guys. It is so soft, and I was kind of scared about buying sweaters from Shein and Romwe because I have before, and they've been bad. But this one is amazing, and I've gotten a lot of compliments on this. It's super soft, which is shocking for the price. Um, it's just this really cute beige, and it has this cool like sweet little girly ruffly sleeve. You can see it has this little tie up, which I think is super cute and on the butt. It has a little slit at your crack. I also got this from Shein, which is another sweater that I'm surprisingly impressed by. It is not like the most well woven sweater, but just by like the feel of it, but I know that like this looks nice on and like people wouldn't be able to tell that it's cheap. I actually went into this really nice boutique and the girl is so bougie that works there and um, she was like obsessed with my sweater and I told her that it was from Shein and she was like shocked. And I love the sleeves. It has like a cute little puffy sleeve and the bottom also is like puffy. So I wear this like um, half tucked it into the front of like a high-waisted pair of jeans with these loafers I got with the fur. Yes, with some skinny jeans and this. So cute with your little black slouchy tote bag. These shoes are actually from Target, $24.99, little Gucci knockoff. Also from Shein, I got this pajama top, but it's not an actual pajama shirt. Like the fabric is actually very nice and the print is not cheaply printed, you know? And I love the black piping, so you can add some like black bold elements to it, to your outfit, and it just has this pocket. So I would just tuck this in, um, like half tuck, like one side tucked in to a pair of skinny jeans. I wouldn't do boyfriend jeans with this because it would look too housey. And then just some flats or something and like some good jewelry to amp it up. From Rome, we I got this gorgeous little mini skirt and it's that men's workswear workwear print i don't know it is everywhere if you have not seen this print all over your instagram feed then i don't know who you're following i got this belt which is from shein and then the skirts from romi they're the exact same print and i think it would be really cute if somehow got an outfit going with both of these together i love that that's super cute but the skirt is really tight and small and it's short so it's definitely not like I would wear this going out. Like I probably wouldn't wear this to like anything work related. Just got a little bit dark out. My camera died. It got a little dark out, so I apologize. One little pair of shoes that I got are these and I've been obsessed with them. These are just some brown like dupes for the Hermé sandals that I'm, I just love the shape of these. I feel like they're just so chic. Like the chicest sandals. Ever. A couple things. Um, I got some things from Nurture Rack. The first one is from Lush and it's this wild little animal print top and I wore this going out last night and I'll post a little pic of me wearing it and I'm obsessed with this tank. 
It was $11, I think, which is a great price. It's Lush, which is the Nordstrom brand. And Lush is normally, it can be pretty expensive, I think. This was probably $40 originally, so that's a really great price. And it's like nice quality, like silky and cute. And it has these little buttons. The next cheetah thing I also got, everything I got from Nordstrom Rack was cheetah print. I know, I'm aggressive. This one is from Topshop and I got it for $27. Originally, I think, let's see it, the tag is still on, $110 for $27. It's actually a size too big, it's a size four, but I just got it, um, I'm gonna definitely have to belt it, but I'm thinking with a big, thick, black, white belt, this would be so cute. Kind of like a chic party dress to wear, or I can even see myself at work wearing it with like a long blazer or something. Um, if I worked at like a fashion company or like for a work event, you could make this really, really fun. And it's long, like it's a midi dress. So it's, even though it's low cut, one, I don't have boobs, so it's not like inappropriate looking. And even though it's leopard, it's like long. And the fabric is very thick. It's not like a slinky, sexy dress. So this is kind of interesting. I'm interested to see what you guys have to say about this, but my mom got this for me because she really wanted it me to get it. It's by Jolt, um, and it was $39.97, originally $64. And it is a leopard long line vest, and it has like raw edges. It has like that texture of fur. It's like faux fur though. And I was thinking maybe I could wear this like to work. Um, if I had an internship, like in the colder seasons, you could wear this with just some um, trousers and like a plain top. Like it's just like a long line vest, but you could also wear it to be warm because it is kind of thick and warm. And it comes with this detachable fur thing. So like if you were being bougie and like was visiting the city and like the fall or winter, like you could wear it with the fur. I do really like it, but I'm wondering if it looks very dated. I, I mean, I love leopard and I think this is so unique and that's, I like things where people look at it and they're like, D have no idea where it could be from. Does this look like something that someone would wear a couple years ago? Last thing I got from Merch and Rack was actually these gold ball earrings. You guys know if you watch my outfit of the weeks that I do all the time, that I wear my white pearls all the time. These gold ones I'm obsessed with because I wear gold jewelry all the time and I feel like they're just, they're super cute. I got this from Free People from a boutique. It was kind of expensive. I think it was like 48. And you guys know me, I'm cheap when it comes to clothes. So I want to invest in things that I can wear for longer and that are better quality. So I got this Free People top and I'm obsessed with it. I've worn it, I wore it in my last outfit of the week. I've worn this a lot already. And it's just this mock neck top tank top, you can't wear a bra with it because it has this awesome open back. It is such an elegant open back because I hate cutouts in the back, honestly. Most, unless it's just like completely open, I usually hate it. But because this is so thick and nice quality and the shape of this, it's like very elegant. Like if you put your hair up, you just, I don't know, the back is so pretty. I got this Top Shop top, it was probably, $19.99 I think it was on sale and I've worn the crap out of this. I've worn it with just jeans, jean shorts. Um, I've actually worn this going out too. It's like a, one of those choker tops, like uh, such a basic girl. Super easy to throw on for class as well with like jeans. Um, if you don't want to try super hard, you wouldn't be comfy because you're seriously wearing a t-shirt. Two tanks. I'm not sure if I showed this black one in the last video. I love these like thin, like these knit little tanks. They're just better than a cami and like they're good for layering, really simple. This one is from tvdress.com and it's like a boob top, it looks like a boob top, I don't know. But I have worn this to class with like gold necklaces and boyfriend jeans um, and those slide sandals, but you can definitely wear this going out. And then I have this black one from, I think it's also from TV Dress. Just a little slinky black in the top. This bad boy. Oh my gosh, this is such a statement piece into my wardrobe now, and I love this little sweater. So it's also from tvdress.com. It is this red funnel neck sweater, and it has kind of fun little sleeves. It's cropped, and I have worn this twice already. It is so comfy, but it is warm. So I need to wait a little bit more towards winter to wear it again because it is it gets toasty in here, but it's really fun. And 
but I do feel like obnoxious when I wear this because it's so bright, but I do think it's really chic. And red is so in style now. Like red, to me, I think red is like, red and yellow are like the colors right now. This purse from pinklavender.com and it's another kind of Chloe look like purse. I love this. I have a brown and a black bag, but I don't have a good little gray one. So it's just a circle bag. It's super easy to carry and comfy. Like. I like the, sh the straps are just really easy to wear. So this is good for going out and shopping when you have your bag like holding on to you for a long time. Also from TV Dress, I got this little scarf. And the problem is like I love all the mixes of colors, but when I tie it up, it ends up all you sing is just like the blue piping. And it looks really preppy, but I wanted the like green to be pop so I could wear this with like a more bohemian outfit, so I have to work with that. I have these shoes, also from tvdress.com, these studded shoes. Aren't they stunning? And I think they're a copy of Isabel Morant shoes, but I could be wrong, but I love them. They're really a statement, statement shoe. The studs are so nicely put on here, like these are nice shoes, so love those. Last couple things, I have these little necklaces from Madewell. It's a little trio and it says Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And I wear these during the week and people always comment on it. It's kind of fun to wear them, not on the day that they are. So those are on sale $19.99 at Madewell. I'll have them linked down below. And that is it, you guys. I'll be filming out for the weeks more frequently, so you'll probably see some of these pieces styled in those. And that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at Rachel Steed. And